Hi guys. Hello guys. Welcome to Budgets with Elma. Today I have a special guest that's going to be doing a saving challenge with me. Our saving challenges, which is called Saving Challenge with Mini Me. All right. She is my daughter, my youngest daughter, and the whole family is mm -hmm. actually doing a savings challenge for the year. Okay. My youngest one, she is doing a dollar one. My son is doing a higher denomination and of course my oldest who is working she is doing twenty dollars every paycheck and she's a bi-weekly payer okay she has a little part-time job in between going to school okay my 19 year old but as for my youngest one she is the one that's here today and she's gonna be doing her first saving challenge um, that she's doing for the first time and for the new year okay so if you're interested in watching this our um, journey to saving as a family please like subscribe and love the video and also comment below let me know and if you're doing do the, and do it on the notification yes, bell. yes hit the notification bell that's right princess let them know hit the notification bell and let me know if you're doing any saving challenges with your mini me all right with that being said let's get started all so right. first, we're going to count my money. That's right. So count your money. All right, Nay? Okay. All right. Let's go. One, mm -hmm. two, three, four, mm -hmm. five, mm -hmm. six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Correct. So I'm going to also count mine because as she's doing her challenge, I'm going to also do the same challenge with her as well. One of my challenges for the year is to save some dollars. So as she is doing a dollar challenge, I will be doing the same. So I'm going to go ahead and count mine as well on camera so you can see. Me and her are playing the same amount. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So both me and Nay are going to be playing for $10 today, okay? This is her template, so she's going to be circling as she selects um, which number she's doing. Now, the way we're doing the $1 challenge, just to make it a little fun and so she can really enjoy herself, is we're going to be using a dice, okay? And the dice is, of course, one through six, but I have made her number envelopes from one through five. Okay, and on each envelope, she puts something she would like to do with her money, the money she saves. Okay, and so we wrote down the numbers on the blank envelope. Okay, and then two, we wrote down what she wanted to do with the envelope. Okay, and now three, she's going to roll the dice. Whatever number that the dice falls on, she is going to pick up that number envelope and put one dollar in there. Okay, so for this game, she'll be able to play 10 times. And if she happens to roll the dice and it falls on a six, but we only have five envelopes. So that means when it falls on six, she gets to pick out of the one through five envelope. She gets to pick which one she would like to put the money in. Okay. And by the way, once she finishes challenge, she will save $90 all by herself. Okay. Mommy, that's not true. That's not true. Say 90. I should have counted the whole thing. And I say it's, it's 79. 79? What's yeah. 79? That thing. Right here? Yeah. No, it's $90. I should count it. Okay, we'll see at the end. So me and Naomi are debating if she's going to save $78 because she said she counted the circles or if she's going to save 90 just like the templates say. We'll see. At the end of the challenge, we'll count and let's see which one's right, Naomi or me. Also put that in the comments, who you think is correct. <laughs> All right, let's get started. Look, Roll the dice, pumpkin. Roll the dice. Oh, that was wait, quick. Wait. All right. So, Nay landed on six. So, six means you get to pick whatever envelope you want. Shoot. Now, you only have five envelopes. What envelope did you pick? Turn around. Number one. So, number one, put it so the camera can see. Nay picked number one. She put that she wanted to buy some shoes. So she's going to put one of her dollars in the envelope. Go ahead. You only put one dollar. Okay. Just one. Okay. Every time you roll the dice, you get to put another dollar. Okay. 
So let's go. So while Nay is doing that, since she landed on envelope, oh, it says number six. Okay. So that means we get to pick any envelope we want. So I'm going to pick any one that I want. And I need a new cell phone. So I'm going to put it in cell phone. So I'm going to put $1 in my envelope as well. But I picked envelope number five. I'm going to circle one of these. Okay. Because you used $1. So All right. Where I put this out right here? Right here. Anywhere you want. Doesn't matter. Now, roll the dice. Go ahead, Nay. Four. So get envelope number four. Close. All right. So I oh, put... yes, sweetie. Very good. Yes, so... she knows how to read. <laughs> She's a kindergartner. She's real good. So you got number four. So my number four says earring. Her says close. So put $1 in close. And I know how, I know how to do math also. Yeah, she's very good with math. All right. I didn't know what it was 100 plus 100. Tell us, tell us. 200. Woo, you go, girl. All right. Very good. So put it down. Like it doesn't have to go in order. Just put it down I feel like on point. your side. Okay? Now roll the dice. Five. All right. Let's get envelope number five. I'm getting envelope number two. I'm doing it like No, that. no, no, no. You have to get the envelope that the dice falls on. Oh. So that's number five. But I did it by, you say when I, when can... When you land on six, you get to pick any envelope. Okay. Because you only have five envelopes, okay? Make sure you're standing in the view. So you go like this so they can see, okay? So that's number five. Number five means going to the mall and buying something special. Yeah. So I'm going to put... Um, Mama, one dollar in my number five, which is cell phone for me. Again? That's what I got on. number The first time I picked, this time you have to do whatever you fall on. So I'm going to go ahead and color one. And, mm -hmm. and, and I'm going I'm going to do another fun thing on Mama Four. Mama Four is really fun. Okay. Well, let's hope you land on that. Just put them down and let's get going. Come on. Next one. Two. Number two. So dice number two. What does your number two say? Um, Uh-oh, girl. Close. Close. All right. So you're going to have one dollar to close. And my number two is birthday dinner. Ooh. So for my birthday, take myself to a nice dinner. So I put one dollar in that baby. I'm going to dinner with you. Of course. I'll take you, pumpkin. All right. I love dinner, actually. Cool. Now roll your dice. It doesn't have to be in order. Let's go. Okay. And just sometimes do it a little harder, okay? You're doing, you're picking the same numbers all the time. One. One, one and shoes. One is shoes. Good job. So put one dollar in shoes. And mine is nails done. So let's put that baby in. One dollar. Very nice. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and, and put the circle one. one in. And you can go ahead and roll your dice, baby. And you just hit this, so you maybe fell out of frame. Okay? Mm -hmm. Keep going. Let me three. see. You landed on three? All right. Three is... Um, mm -hmm. This one's a big one. That's not three. Oh, that's four. What's my mama three? Three is... And then you want to put these back. Move a little quicker, okay? You're moving too slow. I don't know what's three. Three is toys. That's what you asked for. All right. I don't have no money in here. So mine is eyebrows done. All right, so I'm going to put $1 in mine. So my number three is eyebrows. Your number three is toys. All right, let's go. Roll the dice. Wait, hold Two. on. Two. Uh-oh. Four. Four. Four is off the wall. The four is off the wall for you, and it's airing for me, okay? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to color it in. Move your fingers. All right. Roll your dice. Ooh, two. two. What is number two? Oh, what's my two? My two is missing. Close. Mm -hmm. Close. So let me see what I have. I don't know how much. Mine's this birthday dinner. Close. It has three. Cool. 
It's gonna have three because I have. Yeah. All right. Wait, okay, is mine. dinner? Mine is for dinner. Number two means dinner for me. Do you need help? No, thank you. All right. This is hard to lift it Good up. job, Miha. Let me see what you got here. Hold on. So your number two is for clothes, and mine is for birthday dinner. Good job. Roll your dice. We're almost done. Oh, let me circle that in. I feel like we, I must have missed one because we have two more left. How many dollars do you have left? Two more dollars. So I may be forgetting some. So maybe I've got to color some in. So we got two dollars left. Okay. All right. Five. Five. Mall. To go to the mall. And mine is for cell phone. Mommy needs a new cell phone. So let's go, baby. <laughs> Yes. Cell phone only got one dollar. You got one more, it's two. Ooh, my cell phone envelope is kind of big because you've been landing on five too much. But okay. No, we're not. Mm -hmm. So far, I see we have one, two, three. Roll your dice. Four. That was kind of hard. Mm -hmm. So what's your number four? Off the wall. Okay. So she has off the wall. Go ahead, put your money in. That's it. Mm -hmm. I feel like giving more money so far. I know, but you said you only wanted to pay for 10, so 10 it is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see now. Put it down, turn it around. So for your last envelope, which is number four, she wrote on four, her envelope was off the wall, and mine's was earring, okay? So putting it together, um, I'm going to go ahead. You color the last two circles because we used up all our money. And while my pumpkin is um, highlighting the circles, we're going to continue to do this challenge with multiple videos. And you'll be able to see her and see how she's doing so far while saving money. Okay. And again, welcome to Budgets with Elma. 